And as the search in the Carlton Reserve continues, many are starting to wonder if Brian is even still in there and if he's alive. We spoke to Michael Hawk, a trained survivalist and former Army Special Ops captain. He gives us a sharper insight into how hard it would be to survive in the reserve for this long. The type of survival that he's trying to do while evading from the law is extremely difficult. I would predict that he would probably get ill or injured very soon, and that would drive him out or cause him to be caught. So if he's in fact there, I would put my name on it and say they'll probably find him in the next couple of days if they can keep it up. There's food in the swamp for sure, but it does take work to get it, which requires energy, and you got to know what you're looking for. There are poisonous lookalikes, and if he makes a mistake, that could very well do him in also. They are wearing him down. He is going to make a mistake. He is going to collapse and crumble and come out, or they'll likely find his corpse.